and close the door and the ramp and get ready to go down the mega ramp. All right, let's start the engine. There we go. Okay, and let's hope this works. Okay, <laughs> this is going to be awesome. Welcome back to Beam NG Drive. I feel like driving some vehicles off the mega ramp right here, but mainly focusing on trailers. I've downloaded a bunch of different ones and things are going to get chaotic. So you know what? Let's just go for it, right? Here we go. First vehicle of the day going off the mega ramp. This thing won't gain too much speed, but that trailer, well... <laughs> It's going to get absolutely annihilated. So here we go. Oh, nice and steady. Oh, could be a good landing. Oh, actually, you know what? That was pretty nice. The trailer is intact. It's in great condition. Oh, okay. Well, my car, it, it doesn't look too great. Look at the trailer. Literally no damage. Well, maybe a little bit. So this time I'm actually going to intentionally make it really bad. Okay, that's it. Oh, oh, oh yes. There we go. Yeah, take that trailer. So this is actually the smallest trailer that I've downloaded, which means that the destruction is only going to get worse from here. But you know what? Again, that's not too bad. Could have been a lot worse. And this is what I mean by worse. <laughs> there we go. Oh man, that trailer though, it, it could take a beating. Wait for me, trailer. <laughs> It's going off by itself. All right, down it goes. It's probably going to land in the water, so it won't take too much damage. Look at the tire as well. Look at it go. That's actually pretty impressive. And into the water where it's going to rest. What about my car? Where, where's that? Oh, there it is. Yeah, that doesn't look too good. Now, just before I try out another trailer, I also downloaded a new Widgen mod. So this is the Widgen cheese mod. So we got the cheddar stock here. Uh, we got the mozza hella fast. And you know what? I'm going straight for that. So the author of this mod said they thought the widget looked like a block of cheese. And I totally agree. It really does. Anyway, let's just go for it. I'm pretty sure we are currently in the fastest type of widget. Look, there's the NOS in the back. And let's go for it. Here we go. I mean, you know, it's just cheese. Surely that much damage can't be done to a block of cheese, right? Okay, well, we're about to find out, I guess. Whoa. Okay. Oh, nose down. Oh, decent landing, actually. Damage is minimal. I mean, it's probably still really bad, but yeah, that's actually a pretty good run. But whenever we have a good run, that means we need to do a bad run. And of course, I just realized the number plate literally says cheese on it. That is great. But yeah, we need to do a bad run. We need to slam this thing, make it really crash and destroy it. So here we go. Turn it, try and twist it, make it do weird stuff. There we go. Yes, into a roll. That's what we want. Come on. It's sliding. Not too bad. I mean, this car does have a roll cage in it. So that's probably why not as much damage is being done. So maybe a poor choice mm -hmm. in cheese here. Now check out this thing that I have installed. How awesome is this? Welcome aboard the Melmoth Landliner. Hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. Is that a snowman? A yellow snowman? Interesting. Well, let's take a look at the rest of this. So if I go ahead and press, I think it's, uh, oh, there we go. Look, stairs. So we can go up here and then there's a nice deck chair right here. But of course, we are going to destroy this in just a moment. But let's see what's through here. Okay, so we have a bed. Is this, I'm guessing this is the toilet, right? Yes, it is. But we do have a slight issue and that is, I think it might be too tall to actually get underneath the frame here. But yeah, I don't really know much about this. I'm pretty sure it's for land and sea. I really could be wrong about that. You know what? It doesn't matter because we're just going to go ahead and destroy it. I'm not too sure if this electric car is the right vehicle for the job, but oh, yep. Yeah. <laughs> this is a terrible idea. It's so silent as well. Okay. Is it going to work? Can we feel underneath? Oh, we've done it. We've actually done it. Yes. Oh, no, it's scraping. Come on. Oh, all right. We need to give it a bit of a helping hand here. So I'm just going to go ahead and uh, drag it just a little bit. Oh, okay. There goes the body. That's fine. Who cares about the car anyway? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Is that enough? Come on. Yes, it's going to work. Oh, here we go. Oh, I can't control the vehicle. Losing control. Losing control. This thing weighs far too much for this type of car. Okay, but we are going down. Going about 100 miles per hour. Oh, wait. No, no, we're not. I don't actually know what speed we're going at. I'm just holding the accelerator. So it's all over the place. All right, here we go. Oh, slap. 
<laughs> All the furniture's going everywhere. Whoa, look at that. That looks insane. Okay, we've done a lot of damage so far. Looks like there's some kind of shelf sticking through, but yeah, that was pretty epic. I'm surprised we actually managed to get it down the mega ramp. Oh no, <laughs> the bed. Well, it actually looks in good condition, so I guess that's a win. But let's check out the damage. We, of course, have some uh, exterior damage here, a lot of dents. And then inside, well, everything is everywhere. Where's the snowman gone? I think he's... Oh, there he is. Found him. Now, I would consider that a good run, which of course means we need a bad run, which is still technically a good run. Right, hopefully this vehicle should do a better job of actually towing... Oh, hang on a minute. It's just pushed me down. Um, Okay, this might be worse. Oh, no, we're doing okay. Let's just go ahead and uh, go full speed. That's it. Okay, not too bad. Keep it stable. Keep it stable. This is very hard to steer right now. The camera is going all over the place. Okay, there we go. Yes, looking good, looking good. Let's go ahead, zoom out. Let's try and stay in control and then veer off on the right. Come on. Oh, we're going to hit the side. Oh, there we go. No, the snowman. Yes, there we go. Oh, that is more like it. That was way better than our first run. Look at the damage, the state of it. There goes our chair, plant pot, bunch of other stuff rolling down the hill. Yeah, I think it's fair to say that will not be getting fixed anytime soon. And as for the snowman, well, I don't really want to talk about him. Now, check this awesome mod out. This right here is a clear car trailer. And of course, I'm going to go ahead and put this Lamborghini in there. So the first thing I'm going to do is open up the door and of course, lower the ramp. There we go. Right. Ramp has now been lowered. The Lamborghini is ready to go in there. I've not actually tried this before. So hopefully the Lamborghini does stay in place. Okay. Let's just go ahead. I guess drive the Lamborghini in. All right. Nice and slow now. Nice and steady. There we go. And then just apply the handbrake and hopefully the Lamborghini should just sit there. I'm also going to turn the engine off. Okay. Now looks like we are ready to go. Let me just jump through the door. Just make sure. Oh, I think I'm stuck at the ceiling. Uh, okay, I think we're good. And close the door and the ramp and get ready to go down the mega ramp. Right, let's start the engine. There we go. Okay, and let's hope this works. Okay, <laughs> this is going to be awesome. Three, two, one, go! Uh, it's kind of a slow start, but here we go. Lamborghini in my clear trailer is staying in one spot, which is good. Oh, oh, we're swaying. We are swaying. No, 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 no. Oh, losing control. Oh, the Lamborghini. The glass is shattered. Oh, no. Okay. Ah. Oh, no. Whoa. The trailer has completely torn apart. My Lamborghini is destroyed along with the car that I was driving. Oh, my goodness. Well... <laughs> <laughs> that was a disaster. Man, look at the damage. Now, I think it's fair to say that we need to give that another go. I bet there's probably a way of actually having the Lamborghini in the trailer so it actually sits there even without the handbrake on or something like that. If we could, I don't know, get some rope or something. Right, anyway, let's back in. Let's put the ramp back up and let's just go for it again. All right, so this time I'm hoping I won't lose control, but it's very difficult, right? Let's just try and stay as straight as we can. Oh, that's looking good. This is looking really good. Good. Okay, get ready for the jump. No, it's way again. No, oh, losing control. Oh, it's fine. We can redeem this, right? Okay, no, maybe not. Lamborghini, stay in the trailer. Yeah, not too bad. We're kind of like gliding along the floor. I was going to say minimal damage there, but now <laughs> it's the complete opposite. We've destroyed the trailer and everything else. So great success. You know what? Forget the Lamborghini. We don't need that. Uh, Well, that was a terrible, terrible run. Therefore, I need to use my godly powers to destroy it. Yes. And I'm getting a phone call. Great. Great destruction. Back in sec, Jack. Oh. Now, moving on from the mega ramp, I've downloaded this hay bale right here, which I can drive. So I say we get into some police action, getting some police chasing with this vehicle. I have no idea what it's like to drive. It's actually my first time. Oh, it's really quick. Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely going to crash this. Oh, there's the police now. Okay. Let's see if we can get the police attention and then get them to chase me. Whoa. What the? Just as a wheelie. Let me do a wheelie in front of the police. Maybe that'll wind them up. Yeah, this thing is ridiculous. You can actually get different versions. Oh, don't crash. And this is just the race version, which has a seat on the top. And of course, that huge wing on the back there. <laughs> this thing is ridiculous. Okay, let's take it easy. Oh, look, there's police. Can I annoy them? Oh, 
How did that uh, not... Wait, what? They didn't care that I just almost hit them? I'm on the wrong side of the road. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Uh-oh. Okay, I hit them. Uh-oh. Is this guy mad too? Yes, he's mad. I think I might have buckled the back wheel as well when I hit the car. Full speed. Oh, uh, there's another car. That's ah, all right. Stupid police van. Oh, no, no. <laughs> this is crazy. I'm going so fast. Oh, so many police cars. Okay, we're turning, we're turning. Nice and easy. Wow, I'm surprised I haven't actually fully crashed this thing yet. Oh, but never mind. I spoke too soon. <laughs> Oh, okay. I'm surrounded. Uh oh, oh no, that's that's a big drop. Uh, oh, more damage, bad. The good thing I'm a hay bale. See, I can just kind of like bounce around the place. Look at that. I would say that was a success. We got away from the police. We're fine. But anyway, on that note, I'm going to end this one right here. There's another video on the top right. So make sure you go ahead and check that out. Also, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll hopefully see you in that video right there. Goodbye.